Hello and thanks for watching another quick tips video from Go Engineer. My name is Joe Catrona. Today I'm going to take a quick look at how to use libraries in Enterprise PDM. You may have noticed a nice little uh, bookshelf icon that represents your design libraries inside of SolidWorks over on the task pane on the right hand side. Now these can be used for several things. Probably the most common use is to identify a standards file location out on the network share somewhere or maybe in your PDM and uh, locate that and make it easy to grab some parts uh, directly from that location. So for example, let's say I have all of my standard uh, brackets that we use at my company. What I can do is add a new file location simply browse to that location, select it, and hit OK. What you see is that a new location has been added under my design library tab of this task pane. By selecting that, I can see what's inside of that component, and then I can potentially drag and drop these into an assembly, or right click and open uh, and view the properties and that kind of thing. So let's take an example of using an assembly here and I'll add the first component and then maybe drop in a file from my design library. So that makes it very quick and easy to access files that are commonly used in my company. Another uh, use of these de design libraries is just a, a common location that you're browsing for a lot. Uh, one of the things I like to do is set up any demo locations or training file locations. For example, all of these SolidWorks What's New demonstrations for this year in 2014. By browsing under here, I can use these files and see, just quickly find and access uh, commonly used files. And that may not be the intended use, but uh, it's, it's a great use of the design library. Uh, another thing that you're going to find built in with SolidWorks is the quote unquote design library. Under there you're going to find a lot of kind of example files and uh, starter files. Uh, all of your Weldment profiles are found under there as an example. Also uh, your forming tools, sheet metal forming tools. And then there are also some standardized features, uh, fluid power ports, keyways, uh, those kind of things as an example. Uh, so that's your design library in a nutshell. Great for common components, also great for really commonly used uh, working files and working directories. So leave us a comment, let us know what you think about if you're using the design libraries, if you've got any unique uses of design library. Also feel free to use, leave us a comment if there's any videos you'd like to see from Go Engineer in the future. Thanks for watching.